and I'm back again with another vlog and uh, I just wanted to talk a little bit about being productive I guess and I, I've made videos uh, before about my time management and uh, my daily routine uh, yeah, yeah, th there's a bunch of those on this channel, uh, but th for this one I want to just narrow that down to, uh, the morning, uh, and how I found you, that if you have a good productive morning routine, then uh, ev everything is better, I guess. Yeah, it gets you off to a good start. And uh, this one thing I've heard or seen on the internet uh, is called the 8 by 9 morning routine, where you get eight things done before 9 a.m. Uh, and then they're usually just like small tasks, like make your bed, which I was not good at doing at all. And actually, I'm still not really good at it. I, I just pull the sheets and covers up like, and just call it good. Yeah, yeah, but it works. And uh, another one is uh, take a shower and uh, also eat breakfast and brush your teeth, which, uh, yeah, I, I was actually already doing like half of those things already. Uh, so, sometimes I would take my shower after work if, if I was working a job or I was outdoors getting sweaty. So it made more sense to take a shower after work. But, but yeah, now I'm taking a shower when I get up. Uh, which you, you gotta get up early to get eight things done before 9 a.m. Yeah, you, you can't get up like 15 minutes before 9 a.m. and expect to get uh, everything finished. So you gotta get up early and you gotta go to bed early too. Yeah, which uh, I've fallen into a routine where I'm going to bed at uh, around 11.15 p.m. every night. And, and I'm, I'm actually trying to break that and get into bed earlier. And I've, I've found that even if I'm uh, pretty much ready for bed at like 10 30 ish I'll I'll still go and find something else to do like, like watch another video on YouTube and then then when it gets closer to 11 then I'll get ready for bed even though if I got ready for bed earlier than I would get into bed earlier so that yeah I'm trying to break that and and, and so I can get into bed earlier and get up earlier and yeah and and a couple of other things that I do uh, I do some stretching 
yeah, just like normal uh, stuff you would do before um, a big workout. Yeah, just, just so I can remain flexible, I guess. And, and I've also been trying to work in meditation, but still haven't quite gotten that in. Uh, it, I'll do it for a couple days in a row, but then I'll miss a day and then, then just get out of whack and s stop doing it. So I'm, yeah, trying to get into that eight by nine or 10. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because the, the, the days where I'm more productive, I, I feel really good. And then the days where it feels like I didn't do enough or hardly anything, um, just like, uh, what did I do all day? <laughs> and, and yeah, and I, I think this has been working to help calm my anxiety because there's been days where I just feel uh, like I'm falling behind and uh, I need to hurry up and get going and rush and uh, do more stuff and get more stuff done even though you, I might not have anything to do or or I, I don't have any deadlines or then there's no reason to rush but I just feel like but I, I don't know it just, just feels like I gotta hurry for some reason and I don't know why but if I'm more productive uh, then I, I don't feel that way so yeah yeah uh, a good start to the day is always great yeah 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 so that's going to be it for this video. Uh, until next time, goodbye.